How's it going guys? Welcome back to another spray paint tutorial today. Today we are going to be doing planet rings for, well, planets. This was a request I got from somebody to do, and this was actually my first attempt at doing a planet ring. So this is just based off what I've seen other people do, and I think I did an okay job, and hopefully you think so. So to start off our planet, uh, we're going to do yellow, followed by orange, then red, then we're going to add white. And this isn't going to be like every other planet tutorial that I've shown you. We're not going to simply lay the magazine sheet over, and I'll show you why in a second. Because when you think of a planet with a ring, we think of Saturn. Saturn's got like that, like, street line look to it. I, I guess it's not rocky, it's a gas planet, so it's like street and curved looking. So we're going to take a magazine sheet and fold it in half twice, and just wipe the paint to the side. And that gives you that spherical look, it gives you that rounded look that, you know, when you think of Jupiter and Saturn having. You can do this with poster board, you can do this with paper, I just use magazine sheet because that's what was on hand. And then we're going to do everything the same, we're going to add black for the shading, and then we're going to do some white to give it like a shiny glare, or like a storm cloud like is happening on the planet. Okay, and as you can see, if you look back at some of the paint was actually bleeding through the black. You want to keep it extremely light. I know I always stress keeping your paint light, but for this you want to keep it very light because you're never removing paint. You're just wiping it. So there's the same amount of paint on there. And everything else is old stuff. Adds a little bit of pink, add a little bit of blue. There are just two random colors I picked. The planet and the colors that we're using are not the main point. It's the ring of the planet. So you can use whatever colors you want for it. And of course stars. I don't know what my deal is. <laughs> I was editing this and I watched and it's like, man, I had a lot of stars. See, that would have been good there, but no, I have to add more. <laughs> uh. Okay. Remove the plant and now we're going to start on the ring. And I'm going to slow this next part down because I want to stress this. Take a scrap of, I use poster board because it's a sturdy edge on it. I never turn the poster board. I keep it going the same angle the whole time. Start at the edge of the planet, go out, curve in, go across the planet, and do the same thing. Curve it and go back to the edge. See, you keep it the same angle and you never turn it because it automatically does that when you move to the outside edge like that and curve it. It creates that ring look. And when you go just straight across the planet, it scrapes away the paint to give it that just dimension that's going across the front. In my opinion, it kind of looks like a red Death Star with a ring around it. <laughs> but, like I said, this is my first attempt at it, but it's to give you guys an idea of how to do it. This isn't, like, the best tutorial, but it's to give you an idea. So there you are. Planet ring, and you can use whatever colors you want for it. Just have fun with it. Just practice it. <laughs> As always, guys, thanks for watching. Remember to comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff if you like my videos, and I will see you guys later.